guys happy happy friday even though yesterday was a friday for me because i was off on thursday i was like very excited to be off on thursday actually i did not want to be off on thursday i was going to go into work on thursday but then sometime in the morning i just started to have this cough and then I was sneezing and because I talk so badly about everyone when they're coughing and sneezing and like why didn't you just stay home so I had to take my own advice and so I just went ahead and you know stayed home so yeah but I was off anyway so it really didn't matter And then next week I have Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday off. So. But right now I am heading over to the gym. I was supposed to be taking Zayla to um, school. But when I went to go wake her up, she said she wasn't feeling well. And so I just didn't even bother with it. It's no sense in forcing, you know, your child, especially right now, to go to school when they say they don't feel well. So, I am off to the gym. It is a nice, rainy day. And so, yeah. Right now, it is 7.38 in the morning. I'm trying to see, like... If these people really be here all times of the morning, you would think that these older folks would just kind of stay home. But for some reason, they're still coming out. They're still coming out. What I realize is that older people, that they don't know how to go to sleep and stay home. You know, they don't know how to do that. They like to just, you know, be out no matter what and I mean live your life you know live your life but I don't know I'm starting to sound like Zayla <laughs> I'm starting to sound like Zayla she's rubbing off on me I don't have ageism you guys I'm just thinking like my own grandmother that lady would never sleep like seriously I'm just like and then it was this guy his name was we called him white hat him and the lit our um building owner they would be outside late at night and then it would be up early in the freaking morning and it's like <sighs> when do you people get any sleep so and I guess they figure like they don't know how long they have and I know that's a bad thing. It's not a bad thing. I mean, when you lived your life, it's not a bad thing. But I guess for them, they don't know how long they have. And so they want to enjoy every moment, you know, that they have left. And I can, I get that and I understand that. So, yeah. My face looks so fat. <laughs> looks so fat when I don't have my, heat, my, um, my wigs on. Seriously. Yeah. But it, I kind of feel like my neck is leaning out a little bit. I don't know. My body is up and down, up and down at this point. It doesn't know what it want to do. It don't know whether it want to be slim or whether it wants to be fat. It just all depends on what it needs. And so, yeah. <sighs> I really need to start smoking some marijuana. I feel like if I start smoking... Let me take that back. I really need to start, whatever. Anyway, I'm going in this gym, you guys. I didn't come here just to sit in the parking lot and talk to you guys. Sorry, so, later. Can you run it up or not? I got the truck on the spot.
no worries I got the toys that make a whole lot of noise Oh, you wanna ride, 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 ride. Who gon' die for ya? Is you gon' be loyal to me? It's 11-11, you guys And I am finally finished with the gym Now I'm going over to the post office I need to go wash my car And I need to vacuum this car out Like, seriously But anyway I have a lot to do today because I am getting ready. We did um, two whole cars. It was me, Jazz, and me and three, right? And on the first car, small letters, it said, all you see is... And then How in the world big, is... Big, you know, I didn't think that you, my phone could get on, go along with... Um, it just took up the whole yeah, yeah, Let me turn it down. I, I assumed that my radio that my bluetooth didn't work while we're recording but it actually does oh it's on yeah but um yeah um i need to go do some stuff i need to go find a wig for my birthday i was trying to get one off of amazon you know after being scammed on cc i am like so skeptical about ordering wigs offline now so i'll probably just go get me a little um cheap little synthetic wig and just call it a day because i don't have time to be spending two three hundred dollars on a wig right now i got too many things to do so no we're not doing that i'm gonna go get my nails done so i'm trying to think if i should go get my nails done today being that today is friday hopefully people are at work so i don't know and then i'm gonna think whether or not i want to actually drive there or just take the bus so decisions decisions this is messing up my video right now but decisions decisions so we'll see but anyway let me get out this parking lot all right you guys so <clears throat> i bought two wigs and One of the wigs that I bought is from Phil Beauty and it's a really nice sweet young lady that works in there and she does YouTube as well. So as soon as she posts one of her hair videos, I am going to put her channel up and you guys go and subscribe because She's gonna be very entertaining, trust me. So, but then I went to another here place that's like directly across the street, not directly across the street, but kind of directly across the street. And I kind of gave in and bought a wig that was originally 219 and now is on sale for 169. And so, yeah i spent a little more than i wanted to spend on these wigs today but i figured i was gonna buy one wig for 245 dollars online and so i have two wigs for less than that so i mean that's the way you have to you know see life oh yeah so I'm gonna go right now and I'm gonna try on these wigs. You guys, I cannot believe I left my freaking car on. I'm so glad I wasn't going long, like seriously. That's crazy. Let me shut it off for a second and let it, um, you know, and let it rest, I guess. But this is what happens when you're like so in a rush. It's ridiculous. But yeah, so I'm getting ready to go home and try on my wigs. I'm so excited. I get so excited when I have new wigs. Seriously. I know it's it's sad. But what can I say? What can I say about the sadness of it? It is what it is, you know. It is so it's getting so freaking hot in New York right now. Like today i think it's going to get up to like 70 degrees and i'm really not with this weather 
at all. Anyway, this guy wants to park here because I'm in front of his house. And he, even though he don't own the parking spot, but he wants to park in the parking spot. All right, so we'll chat later. All right, you guys. I want to show you guys the wigs that I bought from the beautiful supply store. So, let me show you guys. All right, so the first wig is... A Swiss lake lace wig. This wig is a four by four. It was sixty bucks. Um, it has a silk base, and I thought that it said that you can use it with. Yeah, so it's curling iron safe up to four hundred degrees, which is absolutely marvelous. All right, let's try her on. Let's see. What is what? Put this hat way more lace. Well, no, it's a silk top. It's a silk top. Yeah, I don't know how I'm going to feel about this particular wig. But, I mean, it's a silk top. So, it's not going to have much part in space with this wig. <sighs> yeah, it's not going to have much part in space, but I guess it'll be okay. You know, I guess it'll be okay. I thought I checked it a little better. I just, I seen it and I really liked it, but I thought I checked the lace and all of that stuff a bit better. So, all right, I'm going to take mine's off. All right, and let's go ahead and let me fluff this one out. So. All right, so of course I have to move the remove the lace. Remove my stocking cap back. So I'm trying to see if I can at least have somewhat of a part on the side. You know, it's not going to be that much of a part on the side, but let's see. I mean, it's not bad because you really can't see, you know, probably once the wig starts to shed and it loses hair, then of course you're going to be able to see it. But as long as it's full right now, then most likely you won't be able to see it. So this is not bad. It's not a bad wig. It doesn't feel, you know overly you know dollish to be synthetic and I actually forgot what it was to have a synthetic wig because I used to wear a synthetic wig all the time and some people used to actually think the synthetic hair was my hair so which is kind of weird but I guess but I think this is cute yeah I think this is cute I'm going to try to put it back to the middle. I'm not even sure if it had a middle. I think it did have a middle part, but now I can't find the middle part. So, I'm just going to create something. So, yeah, I think this is cute. Just to for it to just be thrown on the lace, you know, this not to be cut, you know. I don't think it's bad at all. You know, I don't think it's bad at all. So, you know, I mean, I don't wear my hair like this in the top knot. I've never done this, but I just want to play with it for right now. So, you know, <laughs> all right, maybe not, maybe not. What do you guys think? Yay, nay. I mean, I know I haven't really done anything with it, but just as a throw on, you know, I think it's cute. Yeah, I think it's cute. All right, so let's try the second one on. Ow, don't stick in my hair. Don't stick in my hair. Alright, now the second one is human hair. 
and I didn't, that was the brush. And I told them just, they basically just took this one off of the, the mannequin's head. So, yeah, this one, I would definitely have to wash it, like, really, really well. But I am going to put it on my head right now. I am going to put it on so I can show you guys. Again, this is a silk top. And it has that little bit of lace just to, you know. So, this is it here. And what is this one called? This is called the Persian Remy. Virgin Remy, 100% human hair, 4x4. So, same thing like the other one. Okay. Let's see how this looks. Okay, so first off, the head cap is pretty darn um, small, but I mean, it fits. It's, you know, it fits. Ooh. Yeah, the hair smells like it's been sitting for a while. It really does. This one is going to need a lot more work. It's going to need some washing. It's going to need some straightening and some curling. So this one is just like not a really a throw on. Now, if it had more body to it, like in this part, then you might just be able to, you know, go wild child style with this wig. But yeah, this wig is going to need a lot of of work now I'm thinking about wearing this one for my birthday if I can get it you know to look as good as I want it to look so and how many inches is this because I thought this was all right I don't see the inches on this wig yeah it doesn't have the inches on it but I'm gonna say it's about 20 inches I'm gonna say this is about 20 inches 18 to 20 inches I think I'm gonna say 18 all right, you guys, so I had to switch to my phone because the battery on my camera, it died. So, and I can actually see myself a bit better inside uh, this phone. Let me get that out of there. So, like I said, this is gonna, you know, this is gonna need some work. So, I'm gonna try to definitely work on this. Maybe I'm gonna even, like, of course, you know, cut it and put some layers in it you know just a little bit little layers and curl it and then I think that would look really cute but the hair feels really really nice I will say that truthfully this hair feels pr 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 nicer than any hair that I have brought off of um off AliExpress or Amazon like this hair really feels like human hair all of that other stuff was like between this synthetic here and this here. Like it was like a mix. Like because even this one is supposed to be, this is a, supposed to be a human hair wig. And this one does, doesn't feel nearly as nice as this one does. This one feels like it's a little more, you know, synthetic feeling. It still has a bit of softness in it, but you can tell it's like, you know, it's a mixture. So, but this is cute. I like this.